Well, unfortunately, most women that get ovarian cancer are going to be stage three or four because the cancer sprinkles from the fallopian tubes out onto the ovaries and the peritoneal cavity. And by the time the cancer grows enough to cause symptoms, it's by definition usually stage three or four. That means it's gone into the upper abdomen and may have attached itself to bowels and the omentum and other structures. So what that means is usually a bigger surgery, a big incision. Uh, for risk reduction, we like to do laparoscopy and minimally invasive. Once we're dealing with stage three or four cancer, however, the good old fashioned up and down incision is unfortunately still the best way to access the cancer. And really what our mission is, is to go in there and clean out every nook and cranny of cancer to give the patient the best chance for survival. That's been established over and over in the literature to get every piece out, to optimally debulk, gives the patient the best chance for cure. And common sense will tell you if you give the chemotherapy less to treat, the chemotherapy will have a better chance at curing the cancer. And imagine a, a, a gram of tumor contains a billion cancer cells. A gram is about the size of smaller than a grape. There's nine billion people on this planet. So picture nine grapes. There's as many cells in that if you had tumors, you know, nine grapes of tumor, so to speak, has as many cancer cells as the entire planet has people. So if you look at it that way, there's a lot of cancer cells. You want to get rid of as many as you can. And so it's worth the surgical effort to go in there and spend hours and hours in there cleaning out every little bit that we can so that the patient has a better chance at survival. And that's what we do as GYN oncologists. That's what's beat into us from day one. That's our training and, and that's what we do. Hi, I'm Dr. Jay Harness, and I want to share with you important information that I believe that every newly diagnosed patient with breast cancer needs to know. I'm a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. And I want every woman to know about personalized breast cancer treatment and the genomic test. A test that helps guide a woman and her doctor to the best treatment options for her. Pass it on.